Yeah, I think um, I wasn't happy with the first half performance. And although we had chances and I, I guess limited them to not much, but I just thought our energy wasn't there like we normally, the last three home games we've had. Um, you know, I told them at half time, we've got to, we've got to pick it up. And I felt the effort in the end was, was kind of there, but it was kind of too late. We, we, we didn't think smartly, I don't think. I don't think we didn't really make that final pass again. And, and not just the final pass, just the, the calmness to, to finish too. We've, we had chances. Um, you know, I think they maybe had three really good chances to score. We probably had similar or maybe five, three, four, five chances. And they get two goals and we don't get any. So, yeah. I thought Kennedy looked dangerous and had a couple of good sniffs and one good chance when JJ clipped him in. Um, you know, Quincy and Gooley didn't get many many looks. So, yeah, just in general, it was a um, disappointing afternoon. Um, but I'm not going to fault the whole group for not... Uh, they didn't cave in, they kept going and, and could have maybe got something out of the game in the end. But um, I think our first half performance was, was quite poor for us. Um, as you said earlier, defensively you did well, restricted them to maybe three chances, but of the three they had, they scored two. Mm. How frustrating or disappointing is that? Well, it's frustrating. You know, I, it was a, w a weird one. You, you, know, you, you look at the game as a whole and it's like, do we deserve to win? Maybe not. Um, do we deserve to lose with the general play? Maybe not. Listen, it's a game of goals. We didn't score, and you know we scored one penalty kick. Um, we, we just got to keep going and make sure that we're not um, losing faith in what we're doing. We're getting into the certain spots on the on the field well. I think we're overlapping good. Our switch of play was good. Our general play was what we talked about, but just that final cutting edge is just not quite there, and that confidence right now. So we'll keep going. Um, you know, I felt that again that the, the the chances, difficult chances we created, we, we did well. Sorry, the chances we created were quite difficult to get to that point, but we didn't finish them off. And that's the that's disappointing part that, uh, that sort of sits with us, yeah. Uh, Sean out wide today rather than a little bit underneath where he's been most of the last uh, few games. And uh, you talk a little bit about the decision uh, to play him outside and uh, to, to pair uh, De Prado and mm. uh, Ameriqua up top. Yeah, I just, I think... Um, uh, obviously, Quincy's the central striker, and I think Gooley's a probably better centrally as well. And Sean's played a lot of his career out wide left. Um, he does quite a bit of his um, stuff with us from a central role, drifting out to the left and cutting and, and doing his thing out there. So, um, yeah, I mean, I just we try to I try to get a team that would be attacking and, and do well. Um, it always seems sometimes better on paper and better in your thoughts than uh, what we actually uh, ended up playing like, but. Again, you have these games where you're just you're not quite on it, and you're quite you're not quite at the races. And I think it was one of those games where we're just a bit off. Um, I think I said in the, the telecast, the 65th minute, we just weren't quite at our best, and and we got punished for some chances that they had, and and that's football. And we didn't, you know, we we had no cutting edge in the final third in the end. There's only so much that you can do to maybe help get these guys back on the right track. What would you say about? the leadership of some of the players in the locker room and, and, and something they can do to, to help the team in, in terms of motivation moving forward against New York City? Yeah, I mean, they're good. I mean, you got Jeff and, and you know, Jeff, Jeff's been around the block a lot and, um, he, he, you know, he's very positive. You know, he'll come out of this game um, with positive thoughts and, and, and as you do, you know, you don't get too high when you, when you win and you don't get too low when you lose. You, you can't do that. So I, I think people like Jeff will, will realize that, you know, one of those games we couldn't quite get it together you know we lost you got to pick yourselves up and get ready for the next two games which are away from home um which is always tough in our league but you know funny things happen we're going to go away to two games away and, and hopefully we can get a result like salt lake did to, to us but leadership's not an issue with our team it's, it's being solid and good